There are many different ways to re-symbolize or change the appearance of drawings and views in Open Buildings Designer. One of the most critical ways of doing that is through display styles. Now if we have a look at our model here, what we can see is some different colors going on here. We can see where the cut occurs, everything is predominantly black and everything in the forward view got a bit of a gray shade to it. That's governed by display styles. Now, if we look at our view attributes dialog box, we can see down here we have clip volume settings, and these are driven by what we call display styles. So we have the cut play with a style called cut drawing black, and the forward is using something called a forward drawing half color. And if we hit the three dots, we can change certain appearances of what this looks like. Let's say for argument's sake, we wanted to put everything in the forward view to red, just as an example. We can do that by changing the visible edges to red and you can see everything there in the forward view is now set to red. You may have also noticed when we first started the presentation, we had three views and each view had different symbolic representation. Well, again, those are driven by display styles. So if we were to take a look at, at our internal view over here, a quick access to the display styles can be gained from this drop-down menu. And if we were to choose something like presentation blueprint, you can see display style then is reflected in this view. And if we wanted to change this setting slightly, we can open the display style dialog box and we can look for presentation blueprint and again, alter certain settings. It might be a case that we want the line work to be black. And for that background to be a little bit more pale and for those solid elements, to be the same blue pale. Here we can drag the eyedropper over to the existing color and say okay. So the display styles are very effective in altering the look and feel of your drawings and views. And display styles in combination with a technique called hypermodeling can really bring some designs to life. So we've got this pre-defined section here and the section has a slight dog leg in it. And if we again hover over like we did earlier and hit apply section, you can see here how we've used a combination of different display styles to really lift out this section. As a quick look, in the view attributes, we're using a forward with illustration and a cut drawing black. And if we give that a rotate around, you can see that we have black in the cut and that illustration in the forward view and what it really allows us to do is get in and see that detail of what's occurring right in those section cuts now if we give ourselves a bit of perspective here say an extra wide camera view we can use our mouse to roll in and out and position ourselves and have a good look around If you found this video helpful, please give it a like. If you want to see more such series, consider subscribing to our channel. Thank you, and see you next time.